Today on Ask BRS TV, we answer, how do I mix BRS Pharma two-part solutions by weight? Hey guys, Randy here to answer an Ask BRS TV question from the large reefing community over on Reef to Reef, where P. Lukens decided to start mixing his BRS two-part Pharma additives by weight instead of household measuring cups in order to make one gallon solutions of each and asked us to weigh each component based on our recommended mixing instructions. Well, to answer this question for you, I grabbed a bag of each Pharma additive and weighed them for you based on our mixing instructions, and here's what I came up with. If you're like P. Lukens and buy your two-part additives in larger bulk sizes, there will be some measuring involved to create one-gallon solutions. However, in the long run, you will end up saving on overall cost versus our single-use pouches that come pre-measured and ready to go. For some of those reefers who opt for the larger bulk sizes, a few of you may find it easier to measure the dry powder chemicals by weight rather than measuring them out with a few different size measuring cups. So with that, here's what I found for the weights of our two-part solution mixing instructions. Let's start first with the alkalinity portion using soda ash, where we suggest using two and a third household measuring cups to create a gallon of solution, which ends up weighing 403.5 grams or 0.891 pounds. The calcium chloride portion is next, and from our mixing instructions of using two and a half cups of dry powder to make a gallon of solution, instead of the measuring cups, you could use weight to achieve the same amount, which works out to be about 534 grams or 1.177 pounds. Finally, there's the magnesium portion of our BRS Pharmachems, which requires you to mix different amounts of magnesium chloride and magnesium sulfate to create a gallon solution. Keep in mind that although we do have two options for magnesium solutions, one for two-part maintenance and the other for general adjustments, the vast majority of reefers will use the solution for two-part maintenance, which uses five and a quarter cups magnesium chloride with two cups magnesium sulfate to make a solution. The five and a quarter cups of mag chloride works out to be 1,007.5 grams or 2.221 pounds of dry powder, while the two cups of mag sulfate comes in at 418 grams or 0.922 pounds. So if you're one of those reefers who get their additives in bulk and have a scale at home, this is another option for measuring out the right amount of chems to create gallon solutions, which is easily scaled for making larger batches of two-part, much like we did on the five-gallon buckets for the BRS-160. However, if a single gallon of solution lasts you quite some time and you want to remove a few extra steps of measuring dry powder altogether, the single-use rip-and-dump pouches may be the way to go. Thanks for watching and thank you, P. Lukens, for the great question. If you're looking for some of those more in-depth answers that come from a larger conversation with both the BRS crew and the reefing community, hit us up on our sponsor forum over on Reef to Reef. Check out what everyone's talking about with a link to our forum in the lower left as well as in the description, and we'll see you next time on Ask BRS TV.